Hi, it's me again with Corel Draw Tips and Tricks, and this is going to be about your left hand menu bar. Somebody just did a video stated that they never use the Smart Field tool because it's way down at the bottom or it's even off the screen. If you click on this, uh, you're going to make, if you want all the tools, you need to make sure all of them are checked. But if you have too many, sometimes they will be off the screen. So, Tools you do not need, you might want to, you know, if you don't ever use a transparency tool, you can erase that, or not really erase it, you'll just uncheck it. So we'll go down to the uh, transparency tool and uncheck it and watch it go away. Now, we didn't delete it, it's just not there. But they stated that they wanted their, and I kind of reset my toolbar for the video so I could do this. They wanted their smart tool in 2017, I think they said they have, I have 19. You can move it wherever you want. Hold down the control and the alt button and you'll get this plus sign and then just park it in your menu. And now you have the smart field tool up here that you can use at any given moment by doing this. Also, since I reset mine, I changed it. I use the virtual segment delete key a lot. It's in the fly out of the crop tool. Well, if you will grab it, Holding down the Alt and the Control button, you can drag it out and let's put it right there. So now I have the Virtual Segment Delete key at my whim by instead of going to the crop, which I've taken it out of the crop tool, but now I've got it right there so I can use my Virtual Segment Delete key. It's right there. Smart Field Tool is right there. I don't have to go to a drop down menu. Now all corrals are a little bit different, but this, this will work in all of them. But like I'm saying, if you ever have things going off your pages and down here, there's a way to find them and a way to get them. But if you don't ever use the, well, everybody ought to use the dimension tools, but the connector tools, very seldom I ever use it. I'm just going to uncheck it and watch it go away. It's right there. So now I've got a little more room and it's less confusing if you're never going to use those tools. Put the transparency back. And when you go to tools and save as default, it'll save those settings. But at that time, make sure all your settings are right. I normally have nothing on the screen. I'm making sure and see I've reset something or I'm using somebody else's file. I'm going to make snap two pages on and I'm going to grab this corner and I'm going to bring my, so my, now my rulers are zero, zero. My pen is hairline. My nudge is, 0 0.001, my duplicate distance is zero, my inches, my page size is 40 by 28. And then this is my page. And I'm gonna just go up to tools, save as default, and all these are checked. Next time you open up Corel, everything will still be there. I hope that helped a little bit. Thank you for watching.